I got chills. And I was I was ready to run through the wall. So I gave him scoops. I can't really remember what he said, but definitely some along those lines. But I was really touched by it. No problem. I have no idea what you're talking about, but I'd like to know what what, what was said. What are we what talking about? about AC's uh, pregame speech. I was telling him I can't really remember what he said. Uh, I know he said something about half You know, to us. I don't want to get his words mixed up, but I was I was very touched by. It. I remember getting chills during the pregame speech, and I was ready to run through a wall for sure. You gave you guys a good lift in the first half because RJ scored two of the first three baskets. Then everybody not named RJ scored the next 19. You were a big part of that. Was that something that just kind of, was that just a, 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 the flow of the game kind of thing for you to be in? Absolutely. Involved? Absolutely. Just stepping up, you know, when I know I can. Because you kind of went through a little stretch recently where the ball wasn't falling, especially when, when you were driving. Some of that stuff around the rim wasn't falling. You got one to fall tonight. Right. Did that kind of give you a little extra juice from that? Absolutely. I think those, a couple layups from Georgia Tech got me going. Unfortunately, we lost the game, but I think that was more of a good lift for me. I don't know. Why? With these last few games, I was just it's the the season, around the rim. It's gonna happen. Yep. So I was on myself off practice uh, these last two weeks. I've been on myself about it. But. It looked tonight like on a couple of those, you, your body shielded the defender. And some of the ones you had been missing, you were going right at the rim. It didn't look like you were shielding as much. That yeah. may have been a part of it. Yeah. No, that's definitely a huge part. Give kudos, Lebo. Give kudos, uh, Jonas, our strength coach. You know, if you if you ever watch this, but it's putting work with them. And the biggest thing was just trusting myself again. I lost. A little trust in it, man. Just trust myself again. Cause. Tell me about Armando tonight. Yeah. This was the guy that people have seen an awful lot. And his game, he's been playing very well this year. A lot of not a stat, uh, stats, though. Box sports. He's been doing a lot of other things for you. But he stepped up tonight. He said it was a concerted effort to go inside, establish him, to get you guys going. You know, the one thing I love is that everybody who watches this video, you know, he shut up. That's like, I love that. I was saying that during the game, and I just love to see him get back to him. He really won this game. I think this will get him going for the rest of the season. But I love that he was able to shout out everybody. He's been playing really well. Absolutely. It, it's the non-box score stuff. Right. He's talked about it. Hubert's talked about it. Was this just the next thing you needed was to get him going like this as a team? Most you guys kind of took, took it up another notch? Most definitely. Mondo's always willing to do you know, the non, the non-box score stuff, like you said. But, you know, he's still good of a player. To, he had five assists in every game. Right. He's still good of a player to not get the non, not get the box score touches. Yeah. You know, so. Thanks, Thanks, man. Man. Appreciate it. Thanks.